Time to go to the ballpark. Got the bike parked right here, all gassed up, no problem, ready to rock and roll. Baltimore Orioles pitcher Jeremy Guthrie rides his bike with the same intensity that he plays, appearing just at home here. How's it going? As he is on the pitcher's mound. But this isn't just for fun. I'm going to go full speed off that jump. Let's see how I do. This is his main mode of transportation to and from Camden Yards. It's a three mile trip in each direction. I learned at a really young age if you wanted to go from A to B, the best way to do it uh, was on your bicycle. And so I had really learned to enjoy it, the freedom that comes from riding a bike. Around 2 o'clock, I jump on the bike, put my iPod in the, uh, the mount, throw in some headphones, and, and ride to the field. can listen to three or four songs along the way. It takes me about 15, 20 minutes to get here, depending how fast I ride. If it's a hot day, I'll ride a little bit slower, so I'm not sweating quite as much. In 2007, my first year here in Baltimore, uh, I was already riding my bike, of course. I had already done it for a number of years, but I brought that tradition over here to Baltimore. And initially, a lot of the players were like, why are you riding your bike? That's crazy. And then we had two or three other players. Aubrey Huff was one, Luke Scott. Uh, they went over and got a bike as well. And, uh, you know, pretty soon we had two or three guys riding to the ballpark. It's caught on. I think people see the benefits of it. They see the convenience factor. And I think, at the, you know, you see gas prices go up. No one wants to go there and, and pay $4 a gallon for gas. It just makes a lot of sense. Major League Baseball players in the clubhouse, we go through a ton of plastic bottles. We drink hundreds of... Uh, Bottled waters, Gatorades, Powerades, all of those bottles just went straight into the garbage. And so I asked uh, some of the people with Orioles uh, if we could maybe get some recycle bins with Coca-Cola. We, uh, we were able to continue the, the project Give It Back, which has been done in a number of ballparks and a number of venues across the country. And so, uh, you know, the Orioles are doing their small effort to, to pitch in to save the environment. It's a bike I've been riding now for two years and just, you know, absolutely love it. They're not very common, so uh, you know it kind of has a little bit of style to it as well. This is a Cannondale Hooligan. It's kind of an urban bike. It has their traditional lefty fork here with just the one side, disc brakes. This is kind of like a BMX, but at the same time it has three gears, so I can climb some hills a little bit and I can go a little faster if I want to. It's great exercise as well as uh, helping out the, uh, the atmosphere and helping out the earth. Only a major league player might encounter this kind of roadblock, a ring of autograph seekers.